Aries, K Pisces from kpisces.com. I'm here with your September 2015 love edition. Love scope. Okay, Aries, you know what I was thinking about you? I was in my kitchen and I was like, what about Aries? And you know, what came to me was Aries is going to be a sweetheart this month. Either somebody's going to be treating you really sweet or you're going to be being a sweetheart to some. Body. I feel like some of you may not want to start over with a relationship. Maybe your relationship was facing some dire straits in August or maybe just this summer and you were feeling like, I don't want to start over. And some of you guys, I feel, um, may have fucked up <laughs> and you need to get it together so you're being sweet. Or it could be you just being a sweetheart, just being comforted and content with who it is that you're dealing with or you're going it's going to be coming to you this month okay so I just feel like you can put all your cards on the table maybe even taking your mate for granted I don't know alright so here we go the full reversed it's a lot of different variations of this reading I can feel it um, seven of swords reversed mm hmm okay um, four of cups let me hurry up and get info justice reversed ace of swords and so I feel like was just saying, like with the full being reversed, I feel like may have some okay. Okay. With the with the ace of swords too, with, it's, my, it's a lot of thought processes that's going on right now. I feel like maybe you guys, um, the ones of you that are being sweet to somebody, um, it could be um what could have been happening is you may have just realized that your mate was all that and it's time to get together. A lot of you guys feel like maybe you're hanging on a string and you need to get it together before you get dumped. Maybe you could be also um Feeling like things haven't changed in your relationship because you haven't taken the initiative. Maybe you got a little complacent with your love relationship and you're feeling like, oh, somebody got to do something, you know, and just maybe you're waiting for your mate to reciprocate what it is that you're doing. You know what I mean? I just feel like there's a lot of um, action that needs to be done. Um, I, maybe you, you may have had a conversation about what it is. Maybe you're going to have a conversation about what it is. Maybe you were feeling rushed into a relationship. Maybe you're feeling like you're in a relationship and things not moving and you want things to happen now and it's not happening now. Maybe you're trying to get something from your mate and that's why you're trying to be good. But I just feel this sweet, comforting feeling about your relationships here. Okay. Ace of Pentacles reversed. I feel like the Ace of Pentacles reversed could mean that you're not feeling like either your mate hasn't been given their all or maybe you have been called out as the one who's not given their all. That could be happening. The King of Cups. How precious. The King of Cups is a comforting man. He's all about, you know, love and sweetness and caring and nurturing. You may be getting this feeling this month. You may just be feeling content with what's going on. Maybe you feel like it's time to nurture and love and care on my mate. Because if I don't, I'm going to have a real issue by the end of the month. Okay? I just keep feeling this either discontentment that can turn into something good. Or maybe you feel like... I just feel like you... Okay. A couple things, obviously. Like I said. One of you isn't happy with what's going on with your relationship. One of you feels like things have to change or this relationship will end. All right. Maybe you have to be pull a card. Page of Swords reversed. I feel like the Page of Swords reversed is okay. Maybe you have to be the bearer of bad news. Maybe you're going to break it with somebody. Maybe you feel like, all right, I'm good. So I'm content with the decision that I'm about to make. If this person doesn't get it together, then it's the end of the relationship. You know, we really, something has to give this month. And I feel like Aries is just over it. Over it and tired. Just tired, over, over and tired. Nine of Cups come out reverse. Now, Nine of Cups reverse can mean more than a few things. But I'm going to say in this instance, what do I feel? Things may turn out good but not how you not in the manner that you thought they were going to turn out i think that you may have wanted things to happen one way they're turned out good another way sorry 
but you didn't realize that it could be good this way. Ten of Pentacles. Ten of Pentacles is awesome. Happy home, all that good stuff. Money good, love good, family good. Everything's good. I just feel like there's, for Aries, there's some adjustments that needs to be made this month in love for you. You know, single or not, if you're single and you're feeling like you're unhappy with your situation, maybe you're in a situation ship, maybe you're dealing with somebody, maybe you're on a creep move, maybe you, you know, won't smile to somebody, I don't know, and it shit ain't what it's supposed to be, they ain't coming through what they need to be coming through with, you need to holler at them and let them know, listen here, this is how we're going to fix this thing, and if your mate isn't on board, if they ain't climbing on the ship, do do do. Tell them to walk the plank. So, I just don't feel this panic, frantic feeling from Aries. I feel like Aries is going to be just cool this month. Just cool. Like, all right, we can work with that. You want to do this? All right, well, I'll compromise. Now, it's like Aries is going to take the initiative to work together with whoever they're dealing with to make things right. And if it's not right, you just going to go ahead and get that shovel and dig up that dirt and kick them on down the hole. But I really don't think it's going to be bad. I just don't feel like it's going to be bad for Aries. I feel like it's going to be cool. Like It's like smooth sailing. It's like we're going to tweak this here and there, adjustment here and there. But the relationship, it looks like it's going to be a good, overall, it's going to be a good feeling that you get from this love relationship. Okay, so just adjustments, Aries. Nothing bad. I don't feel anything bad for you. It's not a giant high, but it's not any lows either. Okay, all right, Aries. K Pisces from kpisces.com. Check me out for a tell all no holds bar reading. No lies, no lies, no lies, honey. You want lies? Look in America. I ain't got none for ya. All right, y'all.